I should... did. Oh, fuck my life. <laughs> I hit my fucking knee. Bad. I am trying to recover from having to beat a child's ass. Yes. Oh, I am Next IoT up, project, child taser. Ooh. Oh, I am <laughs> that off that I get. <laughs> uh, we can do that. We just need a couple capacitors. Yep. I mean, <laughs> honestly, it's not a bad idea as long as the kid gets some hurt. Yeah. I can do a little bit of low voltage. I ain't going to hurt him. Just make him sting a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. You need to go ahead and deploy it at restaurants across the country. This is Why the is weirdest my child thing? having an epileptic fit because he was too loud, ma'am? <laughs> it's like nine at night and this train is just blowing away. What the fuck? <laughs> Why the fuck isn't this thing connected? Uh, did you guys have you guys had a meeting for the last two weeks? Uh, we had one last week. Yes, okay. we did, but it was like really quick and we didn't go over a whole lot so we well that chapter, and also bro. we had titty background so i had to go ahead and get rid of that one you had a what background? yeah leon uh, had full on porn hub in the background <laughs> he'll show don't worry he'll show you now don't Did he reply to that leon? <laughs> <laughs> you mean that <sighs> Do I need to stop recording? Um, Fuck me. Uh, oh my god. Because that will not, that'll be taken down from YouTube immediately is the problem. What you gotta do is just just crop Leon out of the meeting completely. Listen, I don't want to have to do more editing than I need to. <laughs> I still have the Winter Yeti behind me, so. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, Leon, um, you, uh, there was something you were supposed to present the last time I was part of the meeting. Uh, yeah, he was supposed to bring you the parts list for the something. Oh, uh, yeah. I forget what project it was. I totally forgot. Yeah, I think it was the, uh, the digital. Hold on, um, I'm going to mute myself. I apologize in advance. Uh. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> oh, I have a screaming kid. I don't think you want to hear that. He wasn't talking about you. I was not talking about you. <laughs> All right, my bad. Uh, um, I know last time, Leon, uh, I think we were talking. You said you didn't have the list done yet. I don't know if you had a chance to work on it more. I have not, guys. I didn't that's, think so. That's okay. Sorry, I'm trying to get my head yeah, down, So, Dude, so I've, already, I've already put some money in the account for okay. um, future parts. So we're about, about $233. Oh um, if anyone wants to donate, um, I'll go ahead and send you my PayPal information. I'll just transfer it to that account. Okay. Yeah, let me uh, give me that information at some point because I'll go ahead and get that taken care of. Will um, you weren't here for the last meeting. My unemployment is gone. So it I'm might aware. be. I thought, it was running around. I thought it was running out like December 1st. Uh, it was supposed to go on longer, but apparently they took a, uh, the extra $600 a week came uh -huh. from your actual balance, not from a backup account. Yeah. So they fucked everybody who was on unemployment. Yep. Fuck! Yeah. Yep. God, I was, every time you think this year can't get worse, it finds a way. <laughs> yeah, so at the moment, I'm basically sacking off my entire 401k just to be able to stay afloat at the moment. Have you... Uh, found anything you're interested in doing um a few jobs um i'm basically everybody's processing my request the what? issue is nowhere's trying to hire because the other issues going on in the world what happened with h and r block i'm still under process oh really yeah okay like literally the job is like my profile literally said is it a perfect fit for the job they've told me i'm a perfect fit but it's under process because, yeah. Okay, that fucking sucks, man. I'm sorry. Yeah. Uh, it's life of 2020. Yay. Yeah. Yep. I mean, dude, it's cool. Um, I mean, the thing is, the donation thing totally voluntary. Um, I'm currently putting in two hundred dollars a month because when we do, we get four percent interest on the account for up to the oh, nice. three thousand dollars, and then one percent thereafter. So I'm okay. trying to make sure they hit that $200 a month. So that's the only reason I'm putting that in. All right. I'll, I'll try to make a small donation if uh, Dude, everything you don't goes have to. You do. You're, you really don't have to right now. 
<laughs> yeah. Either way, I still want to do something because, like, I actually want to build something as soon as we can. Yeah, I agree, dude. I mean, the thing is, the account is for everybody. So once that money is in there, that money belongs to everyone. It's not touched for anything other than project reasons. So once the money's in there, it's not your money. It's the group money. Yep. That's just the agreement for that, okay? Everybody understand that? Yep. Cool. Yeah, just don't give me the password. I don't plan to. I'm, I'm <laughs> I plan on doing all ordering. <laughs> I plan on running the orders past you guys first, but yeah. I will be doing all the ordering. No, I agree. Fair enough. That's good idea. So you did do that to her? Um, so... I think your camera is lagging a little bit there, buddy. <laughs> Who, what? Oh, no, yours is like, so your voice comes, but your mouth moves after. It's like, yeah, I'm using the work camera that they gave me because I refuse to use it for work. Ah, uh, yeah, those things are shitty quality. Cool. Yeah, they're, they're garbage. But you know what? I really don't want to have headphones on right now. Uh, <laughs> mine has a built in mic, but I don't like it. Yeah, I don't like the built in mic in my laptop either. It sucks. Yeah, um, don't disagree with you there either. <laughs> Uh, what else? Uh, um, we did talk about the chapter last time. I haven't read chapter four. Uh, that's on me. I apologize. The yeah, one time, you, I mean, you already know about transistors and everything, though, so it's all good. Oh, yeah, for, for the most part. I mean, honestly, it's better just to play with them. We actually agreed, like, reading these chapters ain't helping us a whole lot. We need to get together and actually do them yeah. instead of reading them. Yeah. Yeah, you know, I'm more of an interactive learner myself. So um, I've actually have gone back to doing my Arduino IDE lessons, cool. and um, I'm doing my 3D um, my 3D CAD lessons. Um, on top of that, I'm still looking at the book, and basically I'm starting from chapter one because I don't feel like I absorbed everything. Yeah. So like, okay. Well, that's what that is. <laughs> so I think I'm gonna take it just a little slower for me. Oh, honestly, it, it's it's a lot of math too. It's it's. Well, I they, love truth is I love I love the book. I truly do. It's a lot of information that I'm not familiar with, so it was kind of hard for me to get all the concepts down. But once I was able to get a lot of them down, I was able to imagine. Um, I was able to imagine how each part worked in my everyday devices. It was actually pretty great. It was actually very eye opening for me. Nice, I love it. It's just that a, it's a lot of things I'm not familiar with, some long ass chapters. I didn't have a lot of time to do it. Then I got sick. And then I realized there was other shit I really wanted to study too. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, right. Honestly, if you want to focus on your area of expertise, oh, I that's, that puts more worth to our core value anyways. Yep. Yeah. I mean, just it's- so I can, Just so I can keep up with you guys, I still plan on studying yeah. part-time. I okay. just won't be keeping up with you guys. I won't be oh, keeping up. Yeah. That's completely fine. Like yep. a basic knowledge is better than no knowledge. So Oh, absolutely. And this it's really cool. Like this 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 book is a really cool book. Eric, kudos on the idea for all of us to read it. It is amazing. I have I've realized a lot of different things. So thank you. And honestly, I think it would be recommended reading for anyone who joins the group. Yeah. But honestly, if you are not familiar with this equipment, if you're not as comfortable with it as you guys are. The person's really going to have to pace themselves because it's a lot of information in one chapter. Oh yeah, yeah. No worries. It, I, I don't disagree with you in any reason. I I don't know. What? What are you trying to say, idiot? Dude, it, it's been a really are you trying long... really hard not to insult me because Matt, that was pretty insulting. No, it's been trying a long... to do. Matt's trying to do the words thing, and it doesn't work very well. <laughs> it's <Not today. laughs> But no, it's it's cool. Like I, I'm getting a lot out of this group, so thank you guys. This is actually uh, really good. I'm loving it. Awesome. Mm -hmm. Shit. Leon, you're super quiet, which is a new and terrifying thing. <laughs> How's that supposed to mean? Honestly, <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I was thinking someone's missing. Where the fuck is Elijah? Oh yeah. Um, Elijah hadn't been on for like the past month. Dude, no, he's always on. He's just always playing something. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he needs to get over it, and if he wants to be part of this, he needs to be part of it. I don't disagree, but you know. Simple as that. I got a new chair. I actually got a gaming chair. For nice. I, I need, I actually, I want to get rid of this. Uh, this chair is like broke. Yep. <laughs> 
I know, but like, look, watch. Like, if I'm sitting straight up. Oh, yeah. Mine was doing that too because I think I was breaking mine. So I had to get a new one and didn't have much lumbar support. This thing has a massaging lumbar support. Yep. I am just sitting here enjoying my fucking day. I bet you it's the same one I was looking at. Uh, I'm I'm pushing that direction. (laughs) Why the fuck is there super glue on uh, whatever? Super so anyways, yeah, sorry I didn't get the stuff for the uh for the project. I've just been super busy. And oh, no, uh, the server the server no. is down at the moment yep. because of power issues. So I have to get it back up. Yep. Cool. Um I just haven't fucked with it since yeah. the power went out. Did you want to let Darnell know that we're um working on trying to get uh retro arc working for PC? Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah. Um, so you can download RetroArch for free on Steam right now. Uh, we're trying to get Netplay to work. Mm-hmm. It's not a great experience, but we're figuring it out. Yeah, so just like, our issues with Netplay the last time we tried to use RetroArch when we were in it's, the middle. It's literally the same issue. It's pretty ass. Yeah, but the, the thing is, though, guys, is that you guys are going through the Steam version of uh, RetroArch. I know. I'm the, telling you, I think it's I think it's better no. if you don't go through that one. So netplay with RetroArch in general is not user friendly. That's the reason why we steered away from it and went to Laka, because Laka is friendly. But yeah, they don't have Laka for PC, right? No, no uh, PC version of Laka. <clears throat> yep. Yeah, I'm willing to go ahead and just scrap it on Steam, and then we can just go ahead and do whatever. I just yeah, I'm I, gonna say, I have the standal- I have like the standalone version on my phone. So yeah, right. Well, no, I I think making it work for with Netplay is going to be easy. It's just like last night. By the time me and you got to it, it was already late. Yeah, it, it's got to be like a midday like work on it when I'm focused. I'm I'm willing to go ahead and start working on it. Basically, like early Saturday, like okay. one of those okay. deals where we just kind of like, okay, is this working? Nope. Fuck. Is Game this deal. working? Um, nope. Fuck. I know for like right. at least the next two or three weekends, um, there will probably be no get-togethers just with holidays going on. Yeah, yeah. probably. Um, I might try to make room for this Saturday because I know you two want to meet. Uh, I don't know how it looks so far, to be honest. It's whatever. Well, Eric wants to just wants a piece of the sausage. No, I, wait. You mean pop can? He wants to pop the tab. Right behind you. He, <laughs> no, he does. I mean, I can't help that. Make it uh, yeah. <laughs> Katie, Katie says she'll share. You know what? You want? Know I, I got a small. I got. I got a small story. Last night while I was sleeping, because we we, we tend to sleep, um, you know, free. Okay, if you catch my drift. Yes. Uh, so I'm I'm like dead asleep, and all of a sudden I feel an intrusion between my butt cheeks. Oh. Well, that's a good thing. It's good luck. I don't know. I don't know what Katie thinks she was doing in her sleep, but she was trying to crawl up in me or something. Cause I don't know what happened. Her hand kept on going where it's just gonna win. Wait, was it her hand? No, was it her... Not yes, no. <laughs> was it was hand? her hand. Or was it, it was definitely it was definitely her hand, and I she didn't. I don't even think she was fully awake. Like I, I said, what are you doing? Well, the best part was like when you started telling the story, she, she, she instantly started laughing as soon as you started telling the story. Yeah, because so you, you know, what, what say. you know it's true at that point. Tell her to try again. Yep. <laughs> she'll get you. And Darnell says, "Try again." No, <laughs> thank you. He well, will thank you. <laughs> Leon, you're welcome. Yes. Thanks, Ryan. <laughs> so glad I he'll message me one day. He's like Darnell. You were right. <laughs> I, know. I know is that, that is not a feeling I want in the middle of my sleep. Trust I mean, me. Yes, it is. That was just <laughs> shot, that was <laughs> It absolutely is. <laughs> Sweet dreams are made of these. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> I'm the one who does the sticking. So oh. was that. Again. <laughs> Change your whole world. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, he needs to go pee again before. Oh, well, I no, he needs uh, to pee one so more time. Right now, what I'm doing is um, I'm converting one of my old PCs to our um, 3D printer server. I'm just getting some new parts for it. I'll be back in a second. Okay. Nice. 
So that's what I'm doing right now. I need to get a new motherboard, um, a new power source, and I think that's about it. So once I get that, I'll be able to get that up and running. Your uh, actual full desktop PC or is it a laptop or what? Desktop. Is desktop, a- what, uh, what, what do you need? Um, I'm just – actually, I already have everything I need. I have a parts list. <laughs> so I know what I need. Um, actually, let me go ahead and pull that up for you. That's what I was meaning is because I might have what you need. Yeah, yep. for an old Dell in- Inspiron yep. uh, 1530 or some shit. Just, just yeah. find a Saturday. We'll all meet Leon's place. Right. Yep. <laughs> yeah, like the parts are not expensive. I just did not want to spend the money this paycheck, so I plan on spending it next paycheck. Bro, but if you don't have to spend money. Okay. What I'm saying. Damn. I have parts. I have hard drives. Not only I've got that, a motherboard. Good company and people to help you build it. Yep, that too. Oh, thank you, guys. Have fun. <laughs> and lots of alcohol. <laughs> lots of alcohol. <laughs> so, who in the place is this happening at? Because I don't have alcohol in my house. Leon's. <laughs> yeah, the mutual meeting spot at the moment has been Leon's house. So, yeah. yeah. Honestly, it, it's a tr- what, it's 23 minutes drive for me, which isn't that bad. Yeah, it's not no, bad it's all. not. Well, unless I'm going home, then I got to avoid the highway. <laughs> Darnell would need a ride because, you know, he I doesn't have a car. Uh, bitch, I'm saving some money in a car. I can't drive around anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> he's, not, he's not like he's working. It's not like he's working from home I'm anymore. I'm the head of the fucking game. <laughs> Right. He was ready for COVID before COVID there was, was nowhere, There is nowhere to go now. So, mm-hmm. what? Right. <laughs> no shit. Honestly, I'm, I'm, I'm like this close to being like, do I want to keep making my car payment? Pretty much. I'm like, oh, well, so thank goodness I didn't buy a car when yes, I was. Yes, Matt. Like, make, keep making your car payment because you need a job. Dude, every job I've applied for has been a 10 minute walk. You need a job. Stop. 10 minute walk. Dude, I, I will walk in the fucking snow. I love it. Yeah, but your uh, lady over there doesn't like walking in the snow. I mean, her job's closer than what mine would be. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> she works at the mall right across the fucking road. <laughs> oh, fair enough. But yeah, um, basically what I need is a new motherboard and new power supply. That's oh, that's all. not bad. Okay. It's doable. Let me let me see what I got down there. I'll I'll see what we can do because I know I'm pretty sure I have a f- couple power supply. I think I might have a 650 uh, watts power supply uh, yeah, modular. It, I believe. I don't think I, it only needs a 250 watt. <laughs> well, it depends on your motherboard too. Yeah. Mm, oh, okay. Honestly, like I if you buy a, if you buy a PC nowadays, honestly, they don't put the power supplies in them that the actual computer needs. So Katie time- says she had your motherboard. <laughs> but as I was saying, I heard that was awful. <laughs> uh, she didn't really say that. I said, <laughs> "Okay, oh, did you say it? No, excuse me. I'm sorry. I, I I did hear her right. She did say it. Wow. Oh, well, tell her that was awful. Slick. Tell her that was awful. Darnell, that was awful. <laughs> One thing I can say is um, <laughs> Dell is actually notorious for putting in lower power supplies than what the computer needs. Yeah, oh, I did not know that. Yeah, yes, they they tend to fuck the customer over. The Inspiron, the Inspiron, the one that you have, uh, it actually was only a three hundred and twenty-five watt power supply, I believe, and it was but recommended like, to have a five hundred. Yeah, yeah. Trust me, I had like three Dells where I actually took it to a friend's house. We cut the tower open and put a better power supply in it because they didn't put the recommended in there. Okay. And my mom was like, but I love Dell. I was like, mom, they suck. Stop. <laughs> they do. <laughs> oh, yeah. I love Dell when I first got him and I'm like, oh, wow. This yeah. I remember you saying you love like Gateway. Like, Gateway was a good company, honestly. It was a good company. I like the cow print. On Dude. The- the, the fucking cow print was the best. <laughs> Dude, my grandpa I, I, I had one of the original ones that had Prodigy still on it. Oh, shit. <laughs> Prodigy 2K dollar. <laughs> Dude, so my grandpa had one, and I remember, Terrible. like, I so I lived in the country my whole life, so I went to my grandpa's house, and he had a fucking gateway computer with uh, AOL dial-up. Yep. That yep. shit was fast <laughs> compared to what I had. God damn. Yep. 
This just reminds me of E Machines. Hold on, apparently I gotta be yeah, a child again. E Machine was good too. Yep. <clears throat> good stuff. So yeah, IOT. Yeah. Yeah, man. <laughs> IOT. So I will try probably within the next week or so. Um, I'll get the list for the uh, for for what we were working on. Um, how far did we even make it on that? We didn't make it very far, did we? Yeah, you were going to show us um, where you had started. I think you were trying to do a sketch. I don't know. I can't remember. You were going to yeah, show. Yeah, I have the I have the sketch up upstairs. So I I have that um, in one of my drawers. I have to start hunt it down. And then I think I had I actually I know I had the parts list saved in my Amazon. Yeah, that's uh, right. so I, I'll have to hunt it down. Okay. And uh, there's some other stuff because I need to update the list because there's uh, items that we uh, that we can add on that are better than what, what I initially used. So okay. um, because I think we can get the uh, whole uh, Raspberry Pi and uh, the cellular and GPS hat all together. Um, I think for like eighty bucks. So. Okay. This this thing isn't going to be cheap to start out with, but oh, excuse me, sorry. Did you I, fart? I did. I man, my stomach has been trashed for like fucking a week. I mean, I'm farting, burping I everything. <laughs> oh, I think that's what Katie was trying to fucking figure out for me last night. <laughs> trying to check my prostate. Jesus Christ, it was all fucked up. If I put this plug up in here. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Oh, hey, we have a lot of wine corks, trust me. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't know what the fuck's been going on. My stomach's been just fucking a mess. Yeah, I know. I had the same feeling. I could barely oh, get the day of work. <laughs> dude, I'm telling you, like, I, I'll, I'll buck through it, but man, it's, it's at times, it's, it's getting me to where I'm fucking buckling over. Mm-hmm. And it's I it I feels like uh, I don't know if it if you have the same feeling but it's, it's like I I'm I'm bloated but I'm not yep and uh, it's just like fucking complete awful trashiness and I've I I mean I'm like drinking Pepto and uh, Tagamet and every like four different medications all at once just to fucking hide the symptoms oh it's fucking terrible I mean I'm glad I live alone because it was not great <laughs> but, like, but there's nothing but there's nothing going on. Yeah. Other than that, it's it just pain in my stomach. Okay, um, I didn't have that. I was like in the bathroom. Like it was like okay, time to go. Like dude, almost every. I wish it was in the bathroom, bathroom because at least I knew shit would be exiting. Yeah, unless it just kept exiting, <laughs> and it wouldn't True. stop exiting, and it asked yep. you to exit every couple of minutes, which yep. fucking sucked. Yep, I get yep. it. <laughs> Eric up there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We get it. Right. Right. <laughs> yeah. I I don't know how I'm on two screens at the moment. It's great. Leon and stereo. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> oh wait. <laughs> I forgot that was Matt. <laughs> yeah. oh, oh. I, if I wasn't muted, you would have heard. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Assholes. Anyways, that's what we were just talking about. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord. Yeah. So uh, I think uh, maybe the we, we should hold off on a couple me- the next couple meetings. Okay. Yeah. And not even yeah, just because we've been we we have been kind of having a hard time getting together on the on these. Maybe uh, hold off until. Holidays are over. Yeah, yeah. So like maybe the fourth. Yeah. What okay. do you think? How about we? Oh, yeah. that, cool? I mean, if, uh, of course, if you guys want to talk and stuff, we're always in chat and stuff. It's, I'm just talking about the like an actual scheduled meeting. Yeah, yeah that's you, fine. I, I, I'm cool so, with like if we meet. Oh, meeting's gonna be on the fourth, and that'll be it. Okay. If you guys want to meet on twenty eighth, just to chat. Sounds like a good idea. Yeah, I'd be happy to yeah. chat. Well, yeah. See you guys next year. <laughs> Right. <laughs> I knew he. I knew, that before. Before. <laughs> I knew he. I knew Eric was gonna be the douchebag to say it, but you know. Yeah. Of course. Right. <laughs> of course. Uh, really, I thought um, he was gonna pull the. So uh, did I? Did I just say anything? Uh, like I haven't seen you guys since last year. Right. Wow. Right. 
Oh, yeah, so oh my God. I have to go on for that. <laughs> what is it? Did I miss anything upstairs or? Upstairs. Did you guys cover what? anything? Did you guys cover anything while I was gone? <laughs> oh, you're breaking up, some dude. So uh, it's the reason I was having a hard time hearing you. Interesting. Okay. Um, I'm assuming uh, you covered nothing while I was gone. S- sounds we good. Talked about. We literally talked about ass. Yeah. Oh. Literally. Literally. <laughs> I missed a lot. Katie's well, inspection <laughs> of it. All right, Matt. Let, let me let me sum it up for you real quick. Okay, ready? Yep. Ass, 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 ass. Right. <laughs> yep, that's it. Damn, that's that's it. <laughs> yes, that is a song. Um, that is a song. That is a song. Yes, it is. Yep. Um. <laughs> yep. We're all in agreement. Ass is a song. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sure there's multiple renditions of it, but you know. Yeah. Uh, so then that means on the next meeting, uh, I will have all the draw. I'll, I'll have what drawings I have for it, uh, okay. and the parts list, and like maybe a drawn up concept of okay. it. You know, and like as in like a like how to like the whole you know the original proposal how we were going to do it. Yeah. Is this yeah. still so, a Baltimore that we're talking about? Yes, but it's no longer Voldemort. So, oh, I know. Because I can't even pronounce Voldemort half the time, so. <laughs> Voldemort? But yeah, it's cool. um, so, yeah, just kind of a rough idea. If anyone, does anyone have anything they want to add to the project, something they think would be a good idea to be part of it? Um, well. I have I will... thoughts available on January the 4th. So, <laughs> I, I will put it this way. I was going to have the plant feeder, like, rebuilt, Kind of got postponed with having no money. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can yeah. <laughs> so, I plan on making a plant feeder for myself. Yeah. As well. Honestly, I just want to get rebuilt, like plant like a couple of herbs in it, kind of get kitchen flow going. I, I kind of want to see yeah. how effective it would be, and if it is something that you know, if it were done well enough, we could actually sell it, like sell an actual plant feeder. But that would be kind of complicated because. There's so many laws and restrictions that it's it really becomes more of a legal issue than a selling issue. So I have a really awesome idea too. I was just thinking about this just while we were sitting here shooting the shit. So we 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 did start to do the pet feeder. Remember that? Yes. A supposed you know pop can or pop bottle uh, pet yeah. feeder. So it was so, like a what it was like I a. Was, yep. Go ahead. Sorry. I was thinking of doing this as well as like making an NFC tag that the animal has to wear so whenever they get close to it it shoots you know it shoots the food out so that like oh. it actually responds to near field communication but but if it's the wrong tag that comes near it a hand comes out and smacks the animal so like get away so you want you want to de- develop an iot device that punishes animals well, dude instead well, just not make just it- punish animals but punishes <laughs> the right the wrong animal for eating the wrong food well, you could do a similar thing, but like <laughs> make, make it so it's tailored to one animal, period. And if it's yeah. like if it recognizes that it, the dog's been fed too many times, maybe make like a dog whistle go off or something. Something, yeah. No, I, I like the idea of the hand coming out and smacking the cat yeah, until until <laughs> someone goes to buy it and they're like, and, oh, and, and we'll and we'll and we'll, and we'll call it the Hankinator until Pia comes <laughs> around. I'm just. <laughs> I'm fuck. I'm <laughs> I'm just saying oh. what Katie says here. I'm I'm just fucking with her. Oh, I know. But, but no, I was actually thinking about that because they do have the uh, the chi- the. They have uh, the one that has the camera. Eaters. Yeah, they have the one that has the camera on it, and you can tap to like send out treats to your animal whenever they're near well, it. And... I, I wasn't talking about the cat. I wasn't talking about the cat. No. So like what I was talking about, they have something that has a microchip in the collar, mm-hmm. so it only responds to that collar. So. The cat can go up and actually, yeah, it's a door that opens up only for that cat. Okay. So essentially the same thing, but we're doing it in reverse. We're actually dumping the uh, dumping the food out for the cat when he gets near it, and then if another cat gets near that fo- feeder, he's not allowed getting the food. So it won't it won't dump out for him. I feel like See what I'm saying it might need yeah. something more. Well, yeah, of course. Yeah. Uh, what I'm saying is a concept. Yeah, as yeah. a concept, it, I, I want to be able to do it to where it does that, and then like on top of that, if within you could put a timer on it, and 
if within two hours of the cat eating the food, if that same chip comes near to the food, it can't dump out. Is there a so way to make it isolated, maybe? Because, like, if, say someone has multiple cats, what's going to stop another cat from stealing that food? That's a door that shuts up on it. Yeah. Okay, so... so but we got to make it practical for the household use, too, is the, what we got to work on. Cat right? owners feed their animals at certain times of the day because they want their animal to expect food at that time rather than eating all day long. So you make, well, that's the point, yes. Yeah, make it an option. Like, make it so the food disperses at that time. But only for that certain animal, like, in their own isolated area. That, yes, that's my point, yes. Something, okay. something of that sort. Okay, so let me see if I flesh this out a little bit. Let's say someone has one dog. Yep. Would we create this device specifically to feed that dog at certain times or just feed them whenever they approach? Well, with dogs, whenever they approach, it, whenever, whenever, whenever they approach, mm -hmm. but within a certain amount of time frame. So dogs, you're only, are only supposed to eat four times a day, a quarter cup, depending on what, say, say, say that's, that's our, 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 um, yeah. our numbers that we're looking for a quarter cup of food four times a day it doesn't matter when he eats he just has to eat during those four time periods okay so you as someone who, as someone who's raised two dogs i want them to eat a at a certain time of day because then i bitch uh fuck you i've raised two goddamn rottweilers um, i know <laughs> i understand what you're, i know i know what you're talking about so you can keep them on the shit schedule too yeah I, right. I understand it no and that's my point no, my, my thing is is to keep it within so you want to have this animal to eat between 8 a.m and 8 p.m only no, uh, sorry so, the quotations for the word for the dog that you took for a walk that was not right. that was some other bitch's dog. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> so anyways, my point is, is it, that because that dog, honestly and truthfully, I've I've also raised dogs, and mm -hmm. my dog did not eat first thing when she got up in the morning. She didn't like eating first thing in the morning. She liked eating like an hour or two later. So as long as she does, eats within a three hour period, then she gets her food. You see what I'm saying? And then if she doesn't eat in that three hour period, that means she lost a meal and she gets Whatever. nothing. For, well, I mean, essentially, yes. So basically, she misses a meal uh, as a poor. It's not going to kill her. I mean, obviously, it's not going to kill the food. Or you can actually do do something to where it breaks those four uh, those four quarter cups up into uh, three, uh, basically larger portions. So she's still getting the same amount of calories throughout the day, just in mm -hmm. shorter meals. Hey. So, I mean, I know that's, a, that there's a lot to go in with that, but it's just something I was thinking about before. So, so cause I was thinking about our cats and stuff, uh, with, with this. One thing you could also tap onto this too, cause I was thinking about like maybe a shelter. Excuse me. So you could go ahead and have, um, like kennels set up to Excuse automatically me. go ahead and feed and also go ahead and track, uh, Yep. you know, health and diagnostics and everything of the different animals at a given time, just like regularly throughout the day. Exactly. We, well, and I, I and it would go on as far as that. I was thinking about doing a smart litter box. Well, yeah. To, to check for pH levels and all that shit, because there are things like that out there, but they don't do everything. They don't do all the mapping. No, think, they don't. Well, think about the, uh, the smart fabric. You could just yep. build that into a collar and then you have all your animals diagnostics through the color yeah exactly well right but like uh, like if you're talking about like a um uh well, like, anything that the poop could measure could easily be done through the color instead. no I, I understand i'm talking about like um uh the pound basically like uh fuck i don't remember what it's called now i literally just said it the you talking about like the weight and the pound per metric no no no, no. the pound <laughs> the pound for pound for animals whatever the fuck it's called adoption center anyway uh the pound the point, <laughs> right whatever the, the point is is that you could literally have it where it's like well these kennels are empty so we're not going to monitor those but all the rest of these ones let's go ahead and set it up on automatic timer template the whole nine yards and everything it can be all automatically doled out via iot technology to where it's yep. like hey it's eight o'clock in the morning let's go ahead and do this automatically it automatically goes ahead and feeds them that way Yes, yep. the staff can technically check on them remotely through cameras to make sure, okay, they're not 
whatever, but they don't have to individually go around to every single last animal and do whatever. Because on the one hand, yes, it's a good idea because there's more of the the per, you know, interpersonal react you know interaction there. But yep. it also saves the worker from having to do additional work versus, okay, well, whenever I go to take him for a walk, they're already going to get that interaction anyway. That's kind a personal yep. job. I feel like you're trying to steal something from me. Yeah. <laughs> We're also trying to steal the smart toilet idea from Eli, so it's whatever. <laughs> <You know. laughs> um, God damn, Why what? does everything go, always go back to shit? Well, the worst part is, like, me and... Uh, I remember me and Nate had a plan to uh, steal his idea from a company he was working for, for the smart bed. Yeah, right. Like, at, we are actually, like, at the point that he was at, it was, like, halfway done, almost. Hmm. Should have done it. <laughs> Has anybody heard back from that? No. Eli Eli's... was the guy getting in contact with him, so... Yeah, he said he was living uh, on a farm, and then it was like, okay, cool, and... And Eli's like... Yep. So... I'm starting to lose faith in Eli, guys. I really am. Uh, starting to. I, I lost faith on the first <laughs> meeting, to be honest. I know, I know that's horrible to say. I love Eli to death, but I, like he oh, has... Why. He just... He cares about too many other things. Yeah. yeah. Like, literally, like... What was it, like, two nights ago? I was like, hey, Eli, you want to play Rocket League? He's like, sure! Four hours later, he's like, you ready to play? I was like, yeah, no. four hours ago. Mm. <laughs> four hours. Right. I'm like, people sleep, man. Kinda. Wait. <laughs> what are you talking about sleep for, Matt? <laughs> I mean, occasionally I gotta get some, especially when it comes to making sure kids go to school. Mm. Mm. Well, I mean, online school is a pain in the ass, but it's worth it. <laughs> yeah. No, she's learning way more in online school than she would ever learn in a fucking class. Oh, yeah. No, my Which son's... is sad, but... My son's doing really well with that shit because even though he's like, oh yeah, um, I just oh, went ahead dude. and went on a test. It's like at the same time, whenever we actually sit down and work with him on it, it's like yep. he's got it. So, no, literally, right. like she, like she's learning algebra in kindergarten, dude. dude that's awesome. It's it's fucking stupid, but it's still great awesome, all at the same though. time. Yeah, yeah, but like, what are they gonna expect when fucking second grade rolls around? I ain't ready for it. I ain't that smart. Mm -hmm. Quantum physics. I'm, um, dude. I'm about ready to fucking bet. They want her to plant and raise her own garden and track the progress in kindergarten. That's okay. a bit advanced, but okay. Dude, no, it's like I'm like, dude. When I was in kindergarten, they're like, you want nap time? <laughs> dude, they got angry at me in kindergarten for not collaring inside the lines. Exactly, dude. I'm like, th this is shit that like I don't expect, and they're they're like, hey, buddy, uh, they're just oh. pushing it. Like, I Matt, get it. Like, me, Matt and Darnell are on two different sides of the screen now. That's awesome. Uh, well, uh, Darnell's right below me, which means I'm the top. <laughs> That's what I was going to say. He's just like, ugh. I was fun. waiting for it. I, I just wanted to hear the noise. <laughs> I, I miss making Darnell be able to cringe. <laughs> Matt, all you have to do is show up. True. <laughs> <laughs> It's a love-hate relationship. I make too many jokes. It's a hate-hate <laughs> relationship. <laughs> um, shit. Um, I still like the... I still want to try to implement the idea for a smart bowling alley. Or just like a smart bowling lane. I, I don't really I don't understand what you mean by smart, smart bowling lane because uh, don't aren't the bowling lanes kind of already smart anyways? Are they though? No, I'm talking like one that can track ball motion, track rotation, teach you how to like up your game a little bit. I guess. What when you throw the ball? Like personally, from a like bowling aspect that I've ever learned from. Um, so I would bowl, you know, spin rotation on the hand, increasing like how much you actually put torque on the ball and everything like that. It all came down to okay. a science of like making sure your ball was, you know, like have you ever you? I know at least. All of us have had their own bowling ball before, maybe? I've never had my own, but I've used bowling balls, yes. Okay, so yeah. if you go to someone and you make your own, they literally hollow out the ball. You can put it so that way the weight is on one end of the ball instead of the other, uh, based on the rotation of how you throw the ball and a yeah. bunch of other shit that goes with it. Okay. Um, being someone who's bowled for... I, I, I haven't bowled lately, but 
just being that guy who's like, I throw my ball, I know my rotation has to be on the right side of the ball, because when I spin my hand to the left side, because I bowl on the left side, the ball will rotate to the right based on how I throw it. So I throw it naturally on the left side. The ball will go all the way to the right side and then spin back to the left side to get a stri- like to hit the strike rotation. But based on how I twist my wrist, the the amount of like oomph I put on the ball and everything, if that can be tracked through the lane, knowing like when I throw here, I have a more percentage chance to hit a strike than when I throw from here, and be able to track the ball rotation, how the ball moves down the lane, and getting all the physics behind it would actually make my game better. I'm not okay. saying it'd be useful for everybody, but just having that, like having the stats behind it, just like the NFL has stats on how a quarterback throws the ball now. Yeah. I can only imagine people playing bowling, like people bowling would love those same stats. Well, you know, why don't we implement that with, because bowling would be a good idea, but also what would be a good idea is um, batting cages. Well, you make, like, as long as you make the product good enough, it could be implemented for everything. Well, the, the reason I say batting cages is whenever I was trying to get Lex into softball, um, and I'm, I'm sure she might pick it back up again at some point, it's just obviously this year is not. <laughs> I like not how happening. we all like, right. <laughs> but uh, the, the, the biggest problem she had is if she got in front of an actual human pitcher, she would just kind of, like, seize up. And it was one of those things was like, look, we're going to go ahead and progressively do this faster. You're going to have to get in closer. You're going to have to actually try to hit it because every last one of these is going to be a strike. You know it's going to be a strike. You need to well, hit it down the middle. Um, well, then you run into a, It's a control issue. Uh, well, a, a machine can never replicate a human. I know that. But what I'm getting at is that it could give you an idea of like as far as feedback, like, hey – you well, need to go ahead and swing a little bit sooner. You need to go ahead and try to swing about this point. Here's a replay. Something like that to where so, it like shows you. To improve on your right. idea. Instead of something that shows you, mm-hmm. implement machine that can measure a human and based on their throwing stats, be replicated by a machine. That way you can be like, this is my opponent. This is how they throw. Here's the stats of how they throw. <clears throat> replicate it. You know, I, I've just completely got disinterested with everything you're talking about. I'm just saying. Bye, Leon. <laughs> I'm just throwing up. Like you guys start talking about. I'm, like, I'm, like, I'm over here, like um. I mean, frankly, I'm not interested in this either. I'm actually looking up um creating augmented realities using 3D CAD. So you guys can continue to go on, but yeah, when you start talking about baseball, I was like, oh, that's uh, that's neat. Well, no, I'm just here. I'm saying <laughs> as far as like to help like train and and coach and teach different kids, like oh, especially yeah. if they're oh. just first getting started. Yeah, um, when it comes to kids' sports, parents will invest tons of money. Yeah, dude, kids has tons of like kids are where money potential is. Yeah, kids pets. people kids pay a yeah. ton of money to keep their pets healthy. So you like, guys are literally, right. like, yeah. like anything that can help train or teach a kid or a pet mm-hmm. is or instant money in your life, fucking yeah, world. yeah. <laughs> instant money. No, period. Yeah. <laughs> what about teaching fiancés? No, people don't care. They can get a new one. I mean, I would say the kids are technically <laughs> pets, but they're not as easily trained. Right. <laughs> I mean, that's the truth. The dog looks at me, he's like, you know it. <laughs> and it's a, it's a little bit harder to justify keeping kids in cages, so it's, it's whatever. <laughs> the pain of life. Hey, well, this has been fun. Please don't post this on the internet. Thank you. <laughs> it's, it's going up right after this. <laughs> This is actually a live stream. I don't know. Are we done? Do we have anything for next time? Two weeks from now? Um, um, Leon's going to get um, his part list together. Um, yep. I'm going to research the idea of uh, motion tracking through camera. Kind of get the basis for the uh, b- bowling ball idea. I-, I know you guys might not be interested, but I so what didn't... happened? Wait, 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 wait. So hold back. Instead of the bowling ball idea, what happened to the fucking shopping cart? I mean... Oh yeah, we had the shopping cart idea too. The motion, yeah. I think, and we can, we can actually. That's a, a, honestly, I'm, I'm not, I'm not knocking what you're saying, Matt. No, but no. What I'm saying is, no, it's, it's the I same. Like... It's literally the same technology, so it's not a bad idea. Well, not quite, but yes. Like I, I, I think well, what what I'm what I was saying is is uh the shopping cart thing is something we I think we have all the parts that we need 
uh, in the basement at the moment. So Whoa. I think that's something we can actually start acting on. Oh, well, next time we get together, let's just build the uh, the robot that solves its own maze. We're yeah. going to start yeah, that. Yeah, that's right. Because if we perfect that, then it's just a matter of implicating it into a bigger object. Yeah. What was that, uh, Darnell? Yeah, you broke it. I'm sitting in the bed. Okay. You're heading to bed? <laughs> yeah, I'm an old man. Fuck you. I'm getting there. No worries. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I do. We're only five totally years apart, it. remember? I huh? give me shit all the time for it, but I totally get it because my energy oh, is yeah. fucking sapped this year. No. No, well, like, I'm trying to train myself to be back up at five o'clock in the morning so that um, I can start. Yeah, so I can start going back to the gym because my gym closes early. Dude, no, that is awesome. <laughs> I commend you for that. I don't have a local gym to go to right now. No, Darnell forgets yeah. the Darnell forgets the joke where I used to make uh, the comment that we're only five years apart. Oh fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can always ride the pop can, Jim. <sighs> Well, this awesome. has been fun. I'm um, Leon. I hope you record your finger up your ass later. Enjoy. <laughs> I mean, if she hits it in the right spot, I'm not going to complain. It's listen, just listen. You know, when you go creeping in there, look, hey, when you go creeping in there slowly, there's something wrong. Look, no, man. It's, it's like Darnell said earlier sweet dreams are made of beans. <laughs> 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 And on that note, Darnell is logging out. But it was good seeing you guys. Um, yes. I'll see you at official meeting on the 4th. But if you guys want to chat, just let me know. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to chat next week, so no worries. Um, okay. Even if it's just for fun and maybe shoot ideas for no reason. No serious talk, just shoot ideas. That sounds good. Okay. Whichever. Yep. In the meantime, I'll be studying. So yep. Sounds good. Good luck. All right, All right, <laughs> I'm going to get off here, too. I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right. All right, dudes.